See the Ray Marine, that black plastic killer arm? Yep. That's called a follower. Yep. That's following the big stainless steel killer arm here on the rudder shaft. Yep. See where they're connected right there? Okay. So we're moving with the steering wheel up front, we're moving the tiller arm back and forth, and that's the autopilot tiller arm following. So if this tells the autopilot what direction the rudder is pointed in. And then this big brass, bronze looking cylinder is called a ram. You can see where it's pushing the tiller back and forth. So that's the hydraulic ram. And then looking over there, see that black can that says 12 volts on it? That's your autopilot hydraulic pump. So that will actually pump the ram back and forth with the autopilot depending upon where the tiller the follower tells the autopilot where the rudder is pointed. So all that's simple and straightforward. And then last over here to starboard to my left is that canister, which is the hydraulic reservoir and the pressure gauge on top that should be pressurized up to about 12 o'clock. And you can do that with the bicycle pump. So here is your rudder post. This is your waterproof connection down here. This is your tiller arm that's rotating back and forth. And then this is the top, you can see the square piece up there, and that's where your emergency tiller goes. There's a hole in the floor up there, and then over here past these noisy air conditioners, you can see the arm right here. This is the manual tiller arm right here. And then we've got the red and the blue hoses back there. That's the hot and cold water for the aft deck shower. And we've got spare cradles for your dinghies to go on the roof of the boat. So that's pretty much the whole tour back here.